It's okay, we're just kidding. Elephants cannot fly. So let's get back to more of those non-verbal commands. Let's have our elephants move backwards. Tap to both of their shoulders. Elephants will move to the back. And of course, in order to get the elephants to move forward, just like that, they have to tap right behind both the elephants. Yes, elephants will move forward. The clumsy mahouts dropping their anchors, but not to worry, our ladies to the rescue. Returning the mahouts, the anchors. And it looks like Yang Kuo has one more salute in for everybody. Thank you very much, sweetheart. Now well, let's demonstrate a method of mounting and dismounting an elephant practice in countries such as Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia, as well as Sri Lanka. A few gentle words from the Mahout Gamba will lower her head and trunk so that the Mahout can easily just fly right on, but on, but clumsy man that he is. Oi, Gamba. Gamba will help you. Okay, Gamba, all you have to do is pick up the hat. Return it right back to the Farouk. Okay, nice and easy, just pick it up. Come here. is too playful this afternoon, huh? Luckily, we got one more Aprila is ready. Okay, Aprila. Clean, dry hat, please. I'm sure Aprila is not as playful as Gabi here today. And there we go. Give it to him. Uh, Farouk, I think you have to come down and get it yourself. There we go, she's lowering her trunk once again, this time going down on her front legs. Gamba will help you to take you sure she's not going to kick it back into the water. Okay, extreme trust and faith in uh, his elephant right there. So, looks like she's picking it up, her legs she's ready to kick it. <laughs> Is she going to return him this hat? Okay, she looks like she's using a different tack this time. She's going to suck up the hat. And then she's going to walk over to the root Faro. Take a look at how intelligent she is. Believe it or not, she's taking aim. And just like that, down, down, down it goes to this friendly ride. The pair will then exchange a, a nice trunk to handshake, <laughs> exchanging a few words of gratitude and thanks. And Farouk here being a very lucky man, he's going to get a nice, wet, juicy kiss from a 23-year-old girl. <laughs> okay, how's that feel? I love you. Oh, I love you, he says very sweet. That Okay, now like we promised earlier, we're going to show you how he mounts an elephant and once again they're getting into position. Gabby, when you're ready. <laughs> what do you want, Gabby? What do you want? Okay, remember? He gave me the key. I forgot to give up my Ah, uh, no wonder you're still single. Okay, is that apple enough, Gabby? Let's find out. Once again, into position. And she's lowering her head, her trunk in place and lifting him clean right off his feet. All he has to do is to turn and hop right back on. Thank you, Gamba and the recovery. Okay, the lot is really land now on the wall. The size and strength of an Asian elephant is definitely unfathomable. But despite their big their heavyweights, they're out to prove that they're definitely stronger than their African counterparts. With one playful push, with the trunk down that wall, comes the wall that enter and the brother to the center, not wanting to be left out, is going to use leg strength to get that lock into the water. Bear in mind that a brother who is only 17 years of age and already she possesses immense strength in those legs of us. Clearly right here at the same for Zoo, all we need is raw elephant power. Uh, with just one more kick, I'm pretty sure she'll get it in, and there we go, right into the water. Thank you very much, Aprilla and the whole family. Now let's get that walk out of the way, because making her way into the show, this is Jati. Jati is a 26-year-old Malaysian elephant. Ah, uh, shit. Right over here, what she has on the back, this is known as Dragon Gap. This is what helps men and elephants drag heavy logs out of the dense forest safely and effectively. Modern machinery may have since taken the place of elephants, but modern machinery cannot access and navigate the rock terrain.
way that these elephants are so well trained. The elephants do not rust, corrode, pollute the environment, and best of all, no spare parts needed. Now this lot that Jati is pulling weighs about 400 kilograms and will take 10 men to do the exact same task. As you can see, the Jati no problem as she drags it across the high ground, soft terrain, into the water, and back up onto land. Thank you, Jati and Rama. body weight of an Asian elephant. Now what our ladies in time and that have right over here are coconuts. And for this next segment, I would like all of you to quiet down, prick up your ears, and listen very, very carefully to this. That's one. And then we are the as easy as brushing a peanut. And you can try this at home, but believe me, you won't get very far. Alright, in time, very busy lady today is going to push that huge lock back into the water. Only two pushes and it shows. Well done, in time. Over to the left, Gambia, not quite done yet, is going to roll the lock up onto the right side into the water. So what we see them doing, this is a form of natural exercise for them. And while they can be seen pushing, carrying, and picking aside logs, to make way as the current elephants move through the rainforest in search of food. And for those of you just joining us, let me introduce the elephants a little better to all of you. Over to my right, we have young Intan and Aprila. They are both half-sisters, came to us from Indonesia and are both 17 years of age. Aprila has her name derived from the month that she was born in. No prizes for guessing, it's April. Intan, on the other hand, has her name derived from Bahasa, Indonesia word, which simply translate into diamond. I'm sure you'll all agree with me, she's as precious as the gem that she was named for. But these two young ladies are doing their very best to catch up with the older ladies in the herd, and by older ladies, they look at Gambia over to the left. Gambia is a 23-year-old Malaysian elephant, and despite her age, she is the most playful and cheekiest elephant that we have. Despite of all that, she is also the most gentle elephant that we have, and when it comes to meeting up with guests, Especially young children, Gambia is definitely the mood elephant of choice. Now, now that they've got the logs back up on land, they have to push it back into its original position. Gambia, here yeah, being a pro at the task, all she has to do is to kick it back into place. Now, pro on the other hand, need a little help from Intan to twist it into position before rolling it up the ramp. An elephant's trunk contains about 40,000 muscle units. That's more muscle units than we have in our entire bodies combined. Strong enough to pick up logs and also gentle and sensitive enough to pluck a single blade of grass. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, our people are elephants. Singapore Zoo 
are all trained in similes. You have seen how playful they can be. Take a look at the excellent teamwork they demonstrate amongst each other as they pick up that ball in a massive mound, turn the corner in perfect synchrony and coordination. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the Singapore Zoo Brown.